Uh, Steve here, and I've got my little buddy, what's your name? Fiona. Fiona, all right. And Fiona was my big helper because today we went to Amalthea Cellars and um, and she got to tour their really beautiful facility. What did you see there? Wine barrels. Wine barrels, yeah. Did you think the building was neat? Yeah. And, um, and who was the uh, person who helped us? Do you remember her name? Uh-uh. Her name was Holly. And she showed you all around. She answered all your questions, right? And gave me a cookie. And she gave you a cookie. That's right. Good. Well, one of the things that I got there today was the um, Amalthea Cellars 2010 Cabernet Franc Reserve. And this is what they call a library wine because it's something they've had around for a while. There's limited quantity, um, but they are continue they you can't taste it in their tasting room because they don't have that much of it but um, they do have some left and I picked up a bottle on their recommendation and um, poured a glass and it's terrific um, so a few things about it it's got a great color on it what, what color would you describe that as um, it's a bloody red bloody red <laughs> <laughs> with pink, okay with dark pink in it dark pink yeah and I would black. say so yeah yeah well that's yeah so I would describe this as being a you know pretty rich uh, red with a, that's sort of semi translucent. Um, what do you smell? Disgusting. Okay, there you have it from a six year old. <laughs> disgusting. I would describe the aroma as uh, I have some notes here that I'm looking at. I think it's got um, uh, I get some fresh cut oak. There's um, you know, but it's gentle. It's not like an overpowering uh, oakiness at all. But fresh cut oak, um, green bell pepper, dark fruits, um, kind of uh, some fresh cherry uh, in there, uh, tobacco leaf, a hint of baking spice, um, and some floral notes that are sort of nonspecific but have sort of a nice floral bouquet to it. Um, and... I, I wrote <clears throat> in my notes, I wrote, wow, on the taste, because um, the first thing I got was like this combination of chocolate and dark fruit um, and the oakiness that came through, uh, but really well balanced and delicious. I loved it. Uh, really big flavor. And, um, and then that fruit flavor kind of lingered and developed and you started to get the, the sort of these ripe, fresh fruits, almost like ripe peach and pear. Uh, and fresh fresh cherry in there as it developed. Um, the tannins were, were really gentle, uh, so it's, it's really easy to drink um, and uh, has a just nice silky quality on the tongue. So uh, I would highly recommend it. I mean, this, this is just terrific, so get it while it lasts. Uh, grab the bottle once again here. The 2010 Amalthea Cellars Cabernet Franc there she goes, smelling it again. It's horrible. <laughs> it's <still> horrible. <laughs> Cabernet Franc Reserve. Highly recommended. Give it a try. And Fiona, anything you want to say to our viewers? Yes. What? If you ever smell this wine, you smell it horrible. Okay. Um, to the untrained nose, horrible. <laughs> to the slightly more trained nose, magnificent. All right. See you, everybody. <laughs>